Hello and welcome to Aishwarya's Kitchen. I have noticed that on my channel, the most viewed recipe is Olive Garden's Chicken and Gnocchi Soup. And today, I'll be showing you another soup recipe that is Cream of Mushroom. This recipe is very versatile. You just need to adjust the consistency of it and you can use it to make pies, casseroles and sauces. So without wasting a time, let's start making it. So add a little butter to your pot with some oil, any cooking oil that will help the butter not to burn fast, just a little bit. We are just going to saute all the mushrooms, onions, celery, all the ingredients. All the ingredients and their quantities, you will see it at the end of the video and you will also find them in the description box below, okay? Once the butter melts, we'll go ahead and add garlic. This is chopped garlic. Saute it for a little bit. Now we'll add chopped celery. The garlic aroma is just something else. I love it. Now to this, we'll add chopped onion. Saute the whole thing for like just couple of minutes and after that we are going to add chopped mushrooms. Mix it real quick. Now we are going to cover this all and let the mushroom cooks. It will take like five to six minutes, okay? After five to six minutes, Check your mushroom mixture, stir it, they are cooked. Now if you want, you can cook it a little longer, but I think it's cooked perfectly for me. Turn off the heat and let it cool off. Once it cool off, we are going to make a puree out of it, okay? Now if you enjoy the bites of mushroom in your soup, then before we grind this mixture, we'll take out some and we'll add this at the end, okay? Now let's make a puree out of this mushroom mixture. Now in a pot we are going to add some butter and to this now we'll add flour. Now again all the ingredients and their quantities you will see it at the end of the video and you will also find it in the description box below. In this recipe you can use water or vegetable broth or chicken broth. Now today I'm going to use chicken broth but you can use either of these. Now when the flour is cooked, that is when this starts bubbling, we'll go ahead and add our broth, stir it. And now stir it continuously. You can adjust the quantity of liquid according to what consistency you are looking for. You can add it extra or you can reduce some, okay? Now, we'll go ahead and add the puree. This is the mushroom mixture puree to this liquid. Mix this all good once you add the puree. Now to this, we'll add seasoning. So add the salt. Now be careful with the salt if your broth is already salted. Now we'll add black pepper powder. Now adjust the quantities according to your taste. I'm going to add some dried parsley. You can also add fresh parsley. I had dried one so I added that. Now we'll add cream. You can add just the quantity of the cream as well. You can add extra if you like, or you can reduce it. Once our soup starts simmering, we'll go ahead and add the mushroom bites. And turn off the heat, our soup is ready. Let's serve our hot soup. Now to this, I'm going to swirl some cream. I sauteed a piece of mushroom that goes on the top and 
and some parsley. Your soup is ready. So you saw how easy and quick it was to make the cream of mushroom at home. I guarantee once you make this soup at home, you won't buy the canned mushroom soup ever again. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe and I will see you next time. Bye.